is a trick called double dealing. And we take a pack of cards and uh, literally shuffle them like this so that they're well and truly uh, mixed, as you can see. And then we take them and say to the spectator, cut about half the cards over here and reverse them. So the spectator comes along and cuts half the cards or thereabouts over here and reverses them. You then say to the spectator, cut about half again and reverse them again. So the spectator takes a few cards and reverses them again. So we've arrived at a random set of middle cards. The magician gathers these up together, turns the pack over and looks for the first face-up card, which is here. We then deal four hands. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And we do this until we get to the first face-up card as randomly determined. Now, the idea of the game is that the spectator gets the uh, four top cards, which, believe it or not, turn out to be none other than the four kings. But the magician gets the four bottom cards, and the four bottom cards turn out to be no other than the four aces. Now, as a bonus, let me show you this. If you take the four aces, and you take the four kings, and you put the four kings on top of the four aces, and then just give them a quick random shuffle like this, and then take, say, a cut like that. Now you say to the spectator, look, choose one of these cards for yourself. And say he chooses the top. You then say, look, do it again. Choose one of these two cards for yourself. Well, say he chooses the bottom this time. You then say, look, choose one of these two cards for me. Say he chooses this one. You say, please, do exactly the same again. Choose one of these for me. Well, say he chooses the top card. You then say, look now, choose one for you. So he chooses, say, this one. And you then say, choose one for me. And this is truly random. Say he chooses the top card again. You then do one to him and one here. Now that's a truly random uh, choice of cards. But look what's happened. The spectator once again gets the four kings and the magician once again gets the four aces. And that's double dealing.